When we determine the area of the given polygon, to find the area, we will decompose the area, which means we'll divide the polygon into two polygons. Notice how we can divide the five-sided polygon, called a pentagon, into a rectangle that has dimensions nine centimeters by seven centimeters, and a triangle that has a base of seven centimeters and a height of two centimeters. Of course, the length of the base here is the same as the length of this side here of the rectangle. So now we'll find the area of the rectangle, the area of the triangle, and then sum the areas to find the area of the polygon. Let's go and label the area of the rectangle A sub one and the area of the triangle A sub two which means the total area of the polygon is equal to a sub one plus a sub two. So we have the total area is equal to the area of a sub one, the rectangle, is equal to length times width plus a sub two, the area of the triangle is equal to one half base times height. So the total area is equal to, well length times width would be nine centimeters times seven centimeters and I'm going to go ahead and leave the units in the product to remind us of the units of the area. So again, we have nine centimeters times seven centimeters, and then plus the area of the triangle, which would be one half times the base, which is seven centimeters, times the height, which is two centimeters. So we have the area is equal to, well, nine times seven is 63, so the area of the rectangle is equal to 63 square centimeters. Notice how we get square centimeters because we're multiplying centimeters times centimeters. And then plus, well one half times seven will be 3.5 times two is seven. So the area of the triangle is equal to seven square centimeters. So we have a total area for the polygon of 63 plus seven or 70 square centimeters. A lot of times when determining area, the work will not show the units. The units are only added at the end, but I did want to show it this way, just to reinforce when we determine area, the units are always square units. I hope you found this helpful.